Peter Colton. Good evening, Council, everyone. Uh, I'd like to introduce Mike Vincent, who is the president of the Bridgeville Athletic Association. I'm going to pass a couple of these pictures across to the <coughs> Council, and uh, the rest of them will just be proper room. The only reason we're here tonight, and we will be very brief, is to ask permission to level that piece of ground that is shown in white. Uh, it's outlined in blue and shown in white, which if you go down into Charters Park, as soon as you get up to the, where the soccer fields are, that are mostly used by the St. Clair people, far into that soccer field, if you look at that picture, you can see where the fence is right there, that yellow fence, and, and outlined in white is where we want to just flatten the ground so that the little kids can have a place to practice their people. Nothing else. <coughs> I think that's Ed Snyder's property, isn't it? Okay. <coughs> no, no, no. He owns property down there. Like, what's the age of those players that play on that field? Three and four years old. They uh, yeah, are pretty deep ball players, but uh, we just want to make a tiny little field that would be smaller than the smallest infield we have down in the park. Do you want to move the road over a little bit to make it even a little bigger or anything? Or just um, the only the only thing we would really need to put up at this time is maybe uh, some type of backstop, maybe just a two pieces of six foot right. fence, just so the ball doesn't go flying when the dads pitch it. Uh, eventually, maybe some two benches, and maybe next year try and fence the, the field in itself. But yeah, we just want to flatten it out, and, uh, just make a little a little field there. We could bring it up tonight. Yeah, yeah. Dave, I believe you said you would do the. Uh, we'll do work. everything we can. If, if council would be like, if you find an extra 50 bucks in your back pocket and give to us for topsoil or <laughs> fencing, <laughs> wonderful. If not, we'll, we'll make it flat and then we'll put a formal proposal. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. I just yes, made a list on those. Uh, a couple other things the VA would have. Uh, a wish list we got, like some help with this year if possible. Uh, several things I know that are big jobs, like the parking lot. I know if I talked to Joe, he said he's, he would like to work on that. I know that's not something you can just snap your fingers and sure. fix the parking lot. And, uh, the bathroom is on the Chargers Park. Every time we get have a tournament, it's, it's, they end up clogging up or breaking. I don't know if there's something. You know what our guys were just saying the other day, our, our public works director was just saying the other day that we have to stop putting paper towels in there because mm -hmm. they just shove them down there mm -hmm. and we're, we're digging out paper paper towels out of those, all of those bathrooms. It's terrible to say, but we can't we can't put them in the restrooms sure. because they just get I second that motion. Get a big yeah. jug of Purell and put it in there. Yeah. Wipe it on your jeans. Yeah. You should get some hand towels in your tournaments for that reason. Yeah. yeah. And that's and that's what's happening again. And then after they go down and dig out everything, and they say, well, "Why are we still putting these in here?" But they still put them in. <laughs> so. How often they suck it out? How often do they suck it out yeah, down there? Yeah. Clean it up. Well, the backer usually goes down once or twice a season, but it's not. It's, it's, it's not that. It's 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 whomever are, are shoving things down in our toilet. So if we don't put anything in there except some Purell, and hopefully the toilet paper they won't shove that down in there. So what happens is they shove it down in, and then on Monday mornings we have the our guys are down there. So, Fortunately, a lot of times it's after hours. Too. Yeah, we, uh, yeah. We feel put down our new business tonight and get everything here. Sure, thank you. Well, well, hold on, you've got to brag yourself a little bit about well, the hirings with the green. Oh, the, uh, yeah, one of the items on there is we uh, got an $8,400 grant from the hires to build dugouts up at Cook School, which we'd like to start using more. Um, again, Dave is uh, going to help us try and uh, find the right people to do the work and the uh, VA is going to pay for whatever else we, we need to finish the dugouts. Hopefully we can get that done before. 
small yard tractor so we can drag the fields even this. Right. Mike, whenever you guys do this, because we ran into this when we built our when we built our restrooms up there, labor and industry <coughs> came in and we were chastised for not having a permit to build our own restrooms. Okay. So we certainly won't charge anything, but just make sure we that we have a permit up there because sure. they'll be they I don't know how they okay. find it, but they will they came I already talked to the Bridgeville Building Inspector about it already, and I'll make sure that he's there on site when we put yeah. the police for The dugouts? Yeah, but they're, they're not real big. I, they're I about, put a drawing in on that. They're about four feet. Oh, they so, you know, as far as just, you know, him looking at the drawings and then just issuing a permit, so it's there and there's no issue. Sure, I'll make sure we do that. Okay. We'll keep you guys, whenever we go to do something, we'll contact you guys. Thank you very much. <clears throat> All right, thank you very much. Um, going back to Joe, um, since it's under Parks and Recs, would you want to make a motion? To oh, about the field? Yeah, my yeah. thing is under Parks and Recs. Yeah, I'd make a motion to permit the BAA to uh, grade out that little area at the end of the slot field for the purpose of building a uh, small T ball area for the kids. Excellent. I'll second that. Those in favor? <laughs> 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 Motion carries. Thank you, Joe. Uh, Mayor.